afternoon, everybody. How are we all doing? Sorry, I'm trying to find a bit where my face don't look all blah, blah. So, how are we all doing? So, yeah, it's Thursday today, and I was told I had an appointment about half past 11 today. So, I start obviously, my anxiety started playing up today, and I didn't really want to go. Um, and yeah, certain things that have been happening, it's just affected me a little bit. Nothing, uh, just where I live, it's just it's things always going off. I just didn't want to leave a flat and I was feeling, you know, I'm not, I'm not feeling myself. Then I started thinking, oh, it's someone hacking my phone type of thing. So I didn't really want to go out. Then I went till quarter to 12, I thought, oh, I better go. I'll just make out my car wasn't working. Uh, got there, just, no, it was 11 o'clock, they've already gone. But it's the worst. They said it was well, no, it won't because it was half eleven. So I messaged my CPN and I said, "You said half eleven? No." And then she had the cheek to send me a message that she sent to me. She said, "No, it was eleven o'clock." I'm like, and she showed me a screenshot. I went, "Oh, well, I must have misread it." But to date, I didn't. And sometimes I've got a habit of doing that mis uh, reading messages like someone left me a message yesterday on the video I did about the Hinghams and I apologise I, I must have misread what I misunderstood what you said um my apologies I, I do that quite a lot and I don't mean it I just generally sometimes it doesn't register up here what is being said to me hello Bella Come say hello to everyone say hello oh what's out there she's like oh is that outside Bought a pack of biscuits yesterday on my way from Brooklyn. I live and off out of boyfriends and the pack of crumbs uh, must have bashed about in the tub. So I'm just making them be some noodles for a lunch because she's off school not well. And uh, excuse me. What are you doing? I've done a new intro as well today. Uh, so we'll see how that goes. Um and I've just generally not been feeling myself. I can't really talk about it because I don't want people jumping on my video. Um, what are you doing? About what I want to say, but I, it's n nothing bad or anything. I just, anyway. You know, like I say, um, depression's not great at the minute. And where I live is not helpful. There's always something going off, you know what I mean? There's something always happening and it's not doing me any favours living here. So yeah, I've been using my anti wrinkle cream as well. <laughs> Sometimes it, my skin looks okay, and then there's days where it just looks. Oh. But yeah, Bella, what are you doing? Oh, that's sooty crying. I'm like, who's that meowing? So yeah, I had the repair guy come out this morning, covered in dog hair. I didn't even. When I washed out a bit ago. Didn't bother cleaning my clothes, it was just dog hair, dog hair, cat hair. Has anyone else got any animals and you just, even if you do wipe with that sticky, what you call it, a lint, even if you clean it, you're getting kind and you get out and you're like, where the hell did all that hair come from? So I'll just clean my legs. Anyway, so I feel like at the minute my mind's playing tricks with me, my anxiety is a bit. Uh, Bella, you don't want to stick your nose there, it's some wiry stuff. So when I first moved in this flat, let's say, I, uh, we, I'm in the middle of that and I had issues with my eyes under the units. So every now and again, the people that repair the place come out and they stick some like wiry stuff up, like little wall things under units uh, to prevent anything coming out into the kitchen. Because it's happened to me once when I first moved in, I had to get the neighbour to get it out or like that. Ah, a bit. You want a baby mouse, but oh, oh can't stand anything like that. Uh, but yeah, like I said at the minute, my anxiety is uh, sky high at the minute and I'm overthinking things, I think I'm getting paranoid, I'm thinking people are talking about me, which I know is a fact that is happening and you get it anywhere. But yeah, I know, I know for the fact I'm getting spoke about and it's not in a good way either. But you know, it's life I guess. Anyhow, um why do you cats sound like you've got eye heels on? It's a claws. She needs a claws clipping. And they all sound like they've got eye heels on. Um, so, yeah. So, I'm not myself. 100% self. Also, I was on TikTok yesterday. And I follow um, a lady called Leanne. 
and she suffers with fibro as well. I'm going to go there just to have a look at videos and see what they've got in the TikTok shop and stuff like that. Uh, very rare that I really buy anything. But she suffers with fibro and I, I noticed that she, she started selling some stuff. Um, and I asked her yesterday, have you got a link? And I'll attach it to my, one of my videos that I do. Um, is it S, S, it, I don't know. Oh, what is it? If I, I can, I'll put the link in my description box. Um, but yeah, she does like stickers. And I'm thinking, is that sticker for the car? Because it's quite, I could do with a decent sticker to go in my car. Oops, I forgot about that. Oh, no, kitty, kitty. I forgot about Olivia's dinner. I'm too busy gabbing away and it's been five minutes, so this should be ready. Uh, let me just go and give her a dinner and I'll come back. It's one of them noodles that you just put hot water over it and leave it to soak. And soak. You know what I mean? Three minutes. <sighs> just give her a dinner. Hey, anyway, what were I saying? Yeah, so. Excuse me, eh? So, yeah, I've seen some of her products and I'm thinking, yeah, I will be buying one for my car because the one I've got, it's like, it's only like small and it says hidden disabilities. Uh, not, oh, no, not all disabilities are visible. Um, So I wanted one for fibro, so I want to get one of them. And when I do, I'll show you it. Uh, I just need to go out till I've got some pennies in my bank before I can do that. Um, what are you doing, Bell Bells? So I'll be doing that, and I think she does bracelets as well. What's that, com how is that website that people can sell stuff on? Is X to E? Is it? I don't know how you spell it. E T S Y, I think. I don't know. I need to go and look again. But anyway, if I do I remember, I will put the link below. She's called Leanne. She's really lovely. She does a lot of videos on about fibro on TikTok. I mean, I do a few, but not as many because I'm not great at. You know, like some people can do TikTok videos and a mime. I can't do stuff like that. I feel uncomfortable. Um, sometimes I feel comfortable. See ya. You're getting fed again, you're not. Oh, no, baby. So yeah. Um, so if you got, if you are on TikTok, she's called Leanne. Um, can't remember the rest of the some with fibro. I think it is. I'm not too sure. Can't remember. My memory's not great either today. So I'll just put it in the description um, box. I did take a screenshot of it as well uh, of what she was selling. So if I remember. I will add it in this video. grooming themselves and what do you want Loxus? what sweet dirty look <laughs> mm, where's your mama? dirty stop out did she, did she go out last night? oh you badly don't eh <laughs> that's how does cat Loxus Eh? Nothing for you, just had a piece of ham. Mm. Yeah, so every time I talk, he's like, mm. he, even though he's had his cloth clicked, it sounds like he's got ail shoes. <laughs> Don't you, Loxus? You click, click, click. This is the one that's got fangs. Looks like a little vampire. Psh, 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 psh. Loxus. 
You a vampire? The one white whisker. <laughs> Everyone goes, how can you tell which cat is which? Because um, there's like five black cats I've got. One's a baby, so you can obviously tell. Sutty is fluffy. This one has got fangs. Loki, which is another one of Hannah's cats, is like huge and heavy. It's like a teddy bear. And Ronnie is just Ronnie. He's always got big eyes, so you can tell who he is. And he's getting like a Loki. What can you smell? It's clean. I cook. I use actually got around to use my air fryer last night cooking some um, barbecue wings for, for Olivia because she, she enjoys them. She, I'm just halfway through eating an apple. Anyway, guys, I'm going to look and leave you because, like I say, I'm not having the best of day with my anxiety and my fibro. I keep. Having these, I don't know if anyone else suffers with it, but I end up with these bad shakes, and it's kind of off putting. You like trying to do an activity or anything around the house, and you're just constantly like that. Um, and I, thought, I was like that a bit ago, and I thought, no, it's not, I've had some tweets, so it's not that. And then that burning sensation in my hands, and oh, I just don't like it, and then. In your feet as well, so you feel like you need to sit down, and you, you just your body just goes into a full-on meltdown, doesn't it? And then you get tired. You're like, I'm sorry, I've just had to, a nap, and uh, um, why am I still tired? I did, didn't exactly sleep very well last night. I've been up most of the majority of the night. Just keep getting worried. I'm worried someone's gonna break in. I start airing. You know, in your mind, just over time, start, and then you think your furniture around your bedroom's moving. All that pile of clothes in the corner, you're like, it's that, it's that monster. <laughs> I know, you know, you're an adult, you still think like a, sometimes think like a kid, it's that like, oh, monster in my corner, what is it? Oh, and you turn like, oh, it's a pile of washing, but then you turn it off again, you're like, oh my god. <laughs> I used to be worse for that when I was a kid, but because I think I feel like at the minute I'm under a bit of pressure with everything that's going off in my life right now. Then I, I start thinking weird things and I'm like, ah, I'm sure someone's going to be hacking into my phone and listening to my conversation. So I've just ignored my phone this morning and text messages. I'm like, mm, sure, it's you that's texting. I just, my trust's gone. And, it, and yeah, anyway, guys, thanks again for watching. And I'll try and put that link below. You should go and check her out. She's It's all made stuff that she does herself. And she knows I'm going to do this because I asked her for the link yesterday. So, I'm going to go off now and edit my video. And hopefully, do it right. And let me know what you think of my intro. I know it's not, I don't know. I don't know if it's any good, but I thought I'd do all right. Anyway, thanks for again watching. And if you're new to this channel, hit that subscribe button like button and that notification bell and i'll catch up with you in the next video see you later